born in Israel, came to New York 10 years ago for school. I've been shooting and writing here ever since. I, I've been shooting using a camera as a diary for probably since age 12 or 14, but I always took it as a diary, not necessarily as art. It was mostly during the army that I started using it more intensively to document moments that I had to deal with later. Um, and when I came to school here, I learned that to some extent what I was doing was art, and I loved the medium of the camera to freeze moments and to be able to catch feelings. Some philosophers claim there's truth in art. I'm still looking for it. I've been looking for true expression of selves in people. I started by traveling a lot and shooting people that seemed extremely comfortable with themselves. And there was something comforting for me in seeing it and something that made both me and other viewers sort of question themselves or wonder how comfortable they are with themselves. Um, these days I'm trying to find this exact same feeling in people I know a little more, in people in New York that come here for that reason. To some extent there are psychological portraits. I can't make assumptions on how the Irish or the Dublin side would be, but with 10 years in New York I've seen a lot of wildness and almost got used to it. I'm hoping people in Dublin appreciate it. There's almost a status quo that there is no status quo here. You, you can try really hard and be extra wild or crazy, but you don't really need to. You essentially can be and do and act any way you want and people don't even give you a second look in the street for that is a very comfortable environment to be inspired in and to explore all sorts of otherwise boundaries or things you thought were outside of the range of normal in other places. I hope European audiences see that it is the people in my portraits are not just strange or crazy for the sake of weirdness. They actually are that way. It's not punk kids in Piccadilly or goth kids in Dublin if you have any. It's uh, people that don't have any particular grouping or costume, so to speak. They have just gotten used to being, acting, doing, dressing any way they like. I find some truth in it, I hope. You too. <sighs> Thank you for the opportunity to come to Dublin. I've been curious for 30 years plus. Um, I'm really happy to be in Dublin. We can be, 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 we